Now, depending on who you talk to, depending on which Google post you do or whatever else, and depending on what industry, these numbers are going to change. Overall averages is what we're talking about here. The overall averages of businesses that will fail in under five years. So we're talking from the day they open to five years later, over 80% of them will no longer be in business five years later. Now that failure could be anything from they've had to declare corporate bankruptcy to personal bankruptcy to they just folded it and walked away. They gave it away to somebody else because they could no longer continue. The vast majority play at that level. So let me ask you this. Would you jump into a lake if you had an 80% chance of drowning? No. If, you knew, if you knew that every time you got on an airplane, there's 80% of planes that go into the air crash before they get off the end of the runway. Would you fly to an airplane? Know. Right? Like you got to stop and think about how big this number actually is. That means that every 10 people you would talk to going on an airplane, eight would die. I'd never fly anywhere. But yet people jump into business every day as though it's no big deal. This is a very big freaking deal. Now you're going to notice on there where it says 15% and five. What does 15% mean? 15% means of those businesses that make it through those first five years, those hellish five years, the 15% of the 20 that remain never make it past survival. And survival is I'm going to work every day, doing the same thing every day, hoping to get by every day, fighting to fight, pay my bills every day, hoping I've got some good months and then I got some bad months and they never get past struggle. Here's why. They started the business year one. They develop some habits. They've never evolved. They've never grown. And they, yeah, they might be in business for 20 years, but they've just been in business for one year duplicated 20 times because they don't know how to adjust or flex. And the vast majority of businesses that Greg and I work with end up in that 15% category. We have some startup business that we work with, but the majority of them end up in that 15%. And all those people in the 15% will say the same thing. Where were you when I got started? Because if I knew then what I know now, everything would be different. And the final part of that's 5%. What is the 5%? The 5% are people that get everything they want of their business and more. Now I'm not talking in the 5%. I'm not talking Amazons. I'm not talking all those big corporations like Walmart and that kind of stuff. They're like the 1% of the 1%. We're talking the 5% of people that own the renovation company that's doing $1 million a year or $2 million a year and they're able to go on vacations and have fun with it and relax. That 5% is what everybody that goes into business who I talk to wishes they had in their life for themselves. And only five people of every hundred that start a business ever get to a semblance of what that looks like. And it doesn't take long. I think the last that I read is it takes less than 10 years to get what you want or not get anything at all. So you can turn whatever you want into a business in a 10 year window or even a five year window. But most people never get past failing. And if they do, they never get past surviving. Anything you want to add, Greg? Yeah. Just to expand on what Dennis is talking about, this is really important. You know, think about that. Like, the examples he gave, 80% of businesses fail, period. 15% don't make more than a fair wage, what we were talking about earlier. 15% don't make more than a fair wage just to do their job. And then 5% make the fair wage and a profit as an owner. Our program, our goal is designed, period. No questions asked to get you in the 5% and to get you there as quickly as we can. So, that is what it's designed for, period. Yeah, it's like, it's like jumping on an airplane and knowing that of all the passengers that are there, this plane will crash. 80% of them are going to die outright. 15% are going to be permanently maimed. And 5% are going to be okay. And the reason these 5% are going to be okay is because they've been given all the things like the air masks, the seat, the, the, the parachutes, the cushions, everything they needed to not die in that. If you had to choose between which passenger you wanted to be, would you want to be the 80, the 15, or the one that's got everything? Okay. Our job is to give you everything, and we have a phenomenal success rate. Hey guys, doing. Dennis Tackman here, and thank you for watching. If you like this video, make sure you go to presenticlass.com. We've got the entire thing laid out so that way you know how to take your business from startup all the way through to sale if you want to, and the things to look up in between as you're going. Also, if your business right now is in a situation where it's just not giving you the lifestyle that you want or things just aren't going the way you want to, you need to fix it, presenticlass.com is also built to help you out as well. So check out presenticlass.com, and we'll see you there.